Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very special guest. This is my niece, Nora. Uh, <laughs> today we thought that we kind of just do a fun video and have her do my makeup. Yeah. So yeah, let's just get started. Uh, so Nora doesn't really know a whole lot about makeup. No. She's only 10. Yeah. So um, I've kind of walked her through a little bit, made her watch some of my videos. So she kind of knew what she was doing and we went through a list of things for her to choose. And in front of us here, we have a bunch of makeup that she has chosen for me. And yeah, I just think we're just gonna get started. Yeah. Get her to put it, on my, put it on my face, yeah. Okay, so like I said, we have a list Let's here of every step, because I had to help her a little bit, just so yeah. she kind of knew, kind it's of like knew. <laughs> so she kind of uh, had an idea of where to go, what step to go from to the next one, because I mean, I mean, why would she know how to do all of this? Uh, you would have know. no idea how to do all this. Okay, let's get started. So for foundation, you know this already. Orange. The orange, her sister called, looks like this is an orange. So she knows that this is what you put it on with, but there's other options. Really? Yes, you can oh, use yeah, brushes. So I used. I like this brush. I like. I like this one. I mean, you can literally apply whatever you like. Yeah. So that one's actually. It should say hi. Yeah, it says on it. Highlight. Oh, it's for highlights. So you kind of like. It gives you hints on some of the brushes. Thank you, brushes. Thank you, brushes. All right. So foundation. I gotta put my bangs back. So foundation. Foundation is first because I don't use primer. And it goes all over your face. All over your face. So what foundation is supposed to do is supposed to help like cover up and even out your skin. Okay. Okay. So for our foundation, she chose an old favorite. This is the Lancome Tante Idol Ultra 24 Hour well, Makeup. I haven't used, like I used to use this one, but I, yeah, it's, I think it might be almost empty. So, but I might have to scrape some of it out of there. Okay. But that is, yeah, that was the old spray? favorite. You pump it. So I usually put it on the back of my hand. Pump it, you can put it on my hand if you want. Okay. Oh yeah, here we go. Oh wow, that's a lot. All right, so then. Is there gonna be enough? If we need more, we can go back for more. Okay. So you can start putting it on the face. Okay. With my finger? If you want to, yeah. Is there any other options? I usually put it first, oh, I spread it on my face with my fingers and then I use my beauty blender, or the sponge. Literally just put it on and then put it all over my face. Kind of I don't know where everything is. No, really. That's okay, I can help you. Oh. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna have enough. Yeah? yeah. No. Yeah, I'll know. <laughs> well, she's all over your face. That's okay. <laughs> That's normal. That's usually what I look like. And then, yeah, you can so you wipe your finger off with that if you want. That's usually what I do. Yeah, that looks better. Right? Yeah, it looks darker. It kind of looks orange. Yeah, it's like my tan color. This is my most tan that I usually ever get. I kind of don't want to get in your hair. That's okay. Like a... No, it's fine. Okay. On. Don't worry about getting close. You're good. Okay. I'm used to having my fingers in my eyes. <laughs> yeah, that looks orange, but that looks good though. You can keep going if you want. Okay. I'm just gonna make you get. Make sure you get all the edges. It's your first time applying makeup. Doing okay. Yeah, I was two years older than you when I started wearing makeup, so you're gonna have a head start. Kind of looks weird because I got it. Like, you can put it on my eyelids if you want to. Okay. You can put it. On, I literally. Yep. I literally spread it all over my entire face. It feels weird touching your eyelids. <laughs> you feel your eye. Yeah. Not yeah, so, that looks better because so before I was avoiding your eyes and yeah. it was so weird. <laughs> Really orange. <laughs> Here, blend it down my neck. Try that. Yeah, then it'll look more normal because it's just on your face. <laughs> and it just looks weird. Yeah, makeup goes everywhere. I usually put it, yeah. Like I said, I usually make myself look more tanned. Mm. I'm trying to get enough. I'm kind of getting it down. <laughs> there we go. Better? Yep, better. All right, next up. Uh, concealer. Concealer. So for concealer, she chose this guy right here, and this is the ColourPop No Filter Concealer, and she chose medium, which I think is a great color to choose. So that one's a little bit easier to apply. Do you know where concealer goes? Not really. Okay, so concealer usually goes under your eyes, makes your eyes look bright, takes away any like dark circles, okay. or if you have like any pimples or anything, 
You put them over top of that, but I don't really, uh, maybe on my chin a little bit, but I don't have that much. <laughs> your eyes look way brighter than your face. That's okay. That's Do okay. I put it over? You can if you want, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so this is meant, like some people like purposely make it a lot brighter under their eyes. There we go. <laughs> it's like just like drawing, like making a picture. And then you do oh, it is. You use the sponge again for that. Okay. And just blend it into the whole eye area. Okay, now I thought you were gonna leave it because then that looks really good. <laughs> yeah, if you blend it in, then I'll make the orange a little brighter. Yeah, exactly. And then I'll make it normal. Yeah, that'll that'd be really good. See, that's what concealer is for. I don't want to get it in your eye. Oh, it's okay. Oh yeah, you're, now it looks like a normal skin tone around your eye. Yeah. So some people also put concealer like, down their nose and on their, a little bit on their forehead. To make it like brighter. Huh, okay. Yeah. I think I might do that. Okay. Just because of orange look. Mm -hmm. doesn't really suit it. <laughs> Just around your eyes look a little weird. Like, so down the nose. On the forehead. And you are. And you don't like you don't watch people do makeup either. You know no. why? Like you watch you watch a lot of YouTube, but you don't watch people do makeup. No, I normally watch people do it on uh, play Minecraft. That's it. You should watch Elder <laughs> Shadow Lady. She's oh, cool. shout out to that person. <laughs> I've never watched people play video games online before until today. Yeah, because we were watching it. Yeah. She is good. <laughs> that looks better. Better? Yeah, much better. Cool. Okay, now face powder. Face powder. So if everything's blended in perfectly, or well, then you take a face powder, and she chose the uh, Cover Fix, my favorite uh, pressed mineral foundation powder. I really like the cover of it. Yeah. It looks cool. This one's my- it's shiny. Yeah, this one's one of my favorites. Shiny. Shiny's nice. So, so this one you apply with a brush normally. It comes, oh, like brush. It comes with a little sponge, but oh, yeah. That's weird. Yeah, you can put it on with a sponge, but I use, oh. I only use it with a sponge if I'm like out. Oh, I thought that was the stuff. Oh, but that's no, no. the stuff. This is the stuff. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So this is like what makes everything kind of like sit into your face better. Makes oh, it look okay. more even. And I use a brush for this. You can kind of tell which one I use. I use that one. I'll use this one. I'll hold it. Yep. So this one you just kind of like dab it on your face. Yep. I like swirl it into my face. Oops, sorry. That's okay. Do you put it on your eyelids as well? Yep. So essentially <laughs> everything that's like skin color, right? Okay. On your neck as well. Mm -hmm. Okay. I put it on. It's all over. There we go. That looks better. I don't want to get it on your lips. Oh, that's okay too. <laughs> oh yeah, much better. So actually I like skin. <laughs> Not orange skin. That's why there's all these layers, because everything just like helps the other product out. So for highlighter, she has one of my old favorites. This is the ColourPop highlighter or Super Shock highlighter in Flexitarian, which is such a pretty So where do you put the color. highlighter here? So highlighter is usually on your cheeks, right oh, at the top of your cheeks. Makes your skin look nice and like you shiny. You use like a brush? You can, yeah. So I use this kind of brush if I do it, or you can use your fingers as well. I think I might use a brush. Okay. And it looks like there's nothing on it, but once you so see you it. You put it on like down there? Uh, like on the high, up, oh. up around your eye, yeah. It's on. It's more is going on than you think. Really? Oh, okay. Do you not see it? No. I kind of see it, yeah. Okay. Well, we can always choose a different highlighter too. If you want. Yeah, a little, a little brighter. I mean, darker. Because this is bright enough. <laughs> okay, we have to take a quick break because my camera overheats every five seconds. So, okay. So, we left off with Nora doing my highlight with the ColourPop one. So, she doesn't love the way this goes on, but we're still going to use it a little bit. Just find another one because, yeah. Yeah, she wanted to try out this one. Here, put it, yeah, right there. It is the Anastasia Amrezi. This is my favorite highlight. I'm very happy she chose that one because it's my favorite. Oh, and guys out there have these palettes with the mirrors. Um, tip. Tip, yes. 
Um, Tip Tuesday, actually, it's Tuesday. <laughs> yeah, Tip Tuesday. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, use toothpaste to clean the mirrors. Just like smear toothpaste on your like with your finger. Yeah, and then use a damp cloth and rub it, and then I had no, I had no idea. Cool. I did not know these things, but I will. I will now. I will now try this. Okay, so let's try this again. Yeah, I can't really see it, so I don't know how much I'm putting on. That's okay. The other one, I bet it would be easier to see. Yeah, it is. You can easier. kind of see the sparkles. Not much. Okay. Alright, you want to use the other one? Yes. Alright, you think Should you... I pick another brush? Yeah, which one do you think that you would use? Um, what are these? Are these like. That's, that's the one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's the brush I use. I was like. Because it's smaller, so you can get in. Okay. Yeah. So this one, it's like a really hard powder. So you kind of like rub your brush right in there. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> oh yeah, I can see this much better. Yeah? Yep. That one's my favorite. Another one? Mm -hmm. There we go. Nice and bright? Yep. Much better. There we go. This is good. So you can see it. You can kind of see nice it. Nice and shiny. Bronzer. Now this is where we're gonna start putting some color on my face. Yeah. Butter bronzer. Yeah. It smells like coconut, like I it, said. It's so nice, yeah. Alright, now Very nice. Do you know where bronzer goes? Um, not really. Okay, so bronzer goes where the sun would naturally make your face darker. So like people usually put bronzer on like a little bit on their foreheads and around their cheeks. A little bit on the nose, a little bit on the chin, not very much, just like makes the outside of your face look a little okay. bit more tanned. So brush. Mm -hmm. I think I might use. Where's that other brush I use? I just want to make sure I'm not picking the right one. This one. Okay, yeah. You usually use a larger brush that helps. That works. And I'll, help. I'll give you one tip. So with bronzer, because it's a darker color, you dip it in and then you do one little tap so a little bit of the excess comes off so you're not putting like all of it on at once. Yeah. Like that. Perfect. Any color coming off? Um, yeah. There we go. Better. Does it look more tan? More bronzy? Yep. <laughs> Next is blush. Did blush. we choose a blush? Yes, we did. You chose the blush palette. So this is an old one. I haven't used, actually used any blushes in a really long time. And this is a blush palette from Smashbox. This is an older one. It has these little pinky tones. I'm not surprised he chose these colors since they're really nice. Blush and highlight palette, but it's mostly just blush. I'm gonna do sparkling one. I like sparkling. You like that one? Yeah. Do you know where blush goes? Cheeks. Cheeks, perfect. All right, and what kind of brush would you use? I'm gonna use this white one. Sure. Ooh. Yeah, you can see the pink now. Yeah. I think I might add a bit of that one sure. just to make it darker. Mm -hmm. So you can see it better. You can kind of see this. Yeah, I think that's more like the highlight shade. So, it's, But I used to use that one when I would do people's makeup and it would be the lightest one so it wouldn't be super intense. Yeah, that looks nice. Should I still use that? If you want to, yeah. You just use a little bit if you want. Oh yeah, that's much better. Yeah? You can kind of see some sparkle to it. Nice! Yeah. Kind of looks like a Barbie. Barbies get blush. Barbies have bright pink blush, yep. Yeah. Yeah, like all over their face. Yeah, all right. Eyebrows. Oh, man. Now this is gonna be interesting. I'm curious to see how you do this, because you chose powder. Which is actually not the, not hard, not easy. Did I put? Yeah, you said this, but we also chose that little pen. Yep. And I also threw this in just because it's kind of fun. So you can choose any of the three. Okay, I'm gonna look at the powder first. I think I'll look at you. Now this was like brown. Yeah, it's really like very very light color. I think. Use a gel. Okay. 
So she's using the, what's it called? This is Gimme Brow? Gimme Brow. Benefit Gimme Brow. This is a good one. I like this, I like that product a lot. There it is. Look at a gem at the Yeah, they have really nice packaging. So you literally just run it through the eyebrows. I brush my eyebrows up too. It's like you comb through them. Comb. Okay. You can wipe off anything too if it gets on them. Oh, yeah. That looks better. Yeah. That actually looks good. There's some chunks. Okay, just, trying to get yeah, you can just keep brushing them. Oh, good. Like what you're doing? Yep. Awesome. That's pretty good if you feel like good with, with what you're doing and you're yeah. never done makeup before. I was about to use do your eyelashes. <laughs> and I'm like, nope, wrong one. That's what it feels like. It feels like it's like a mascara. I mean, honestly, Nora, I'm pretty impressed so far. From yeah, what I can I'm see, I, I'm impressed with myself. I can only see a little bit, but so far, yeah. so good. For your for literally your first time ever doing makeup, so <laughs> that's pretty good. Um, mascara. Nope, eyeshadow. Oh, eyeshadow. The yeah. part that you're excited okay. about the most. So for eyeshadow, Nora chose two palettes. She chose the ColourPop Mara palette, which is a great choice, and I'm not surprised because it has really nice blues in there. And then she also chose a Tarte palette. I forget what this one's called. It's beautiful. It's just called Tarte. Uh, oh, Make Believe in Yourself, it's called. And it had some nice Really nice shimmer. And yeah. Did you smell this one? Oh. That smells like chocolate or like yeah. vanilla. So there's this um, person, it's Wenji. Um, she has this chocolate bar. Palette? Yeah. Yep, yep. And that's where she taught us how to use the toothpaste. Because she oh. uses a lot. So right now I'm doing this nice blue right here, mm -hmm. and I'm just gonna do that. See, I, it's funny, in my last video, Nora, I talked about how I never used blue eyeshadow. I bought that to use it, and I've never used it on my eyes. This is the it's time. time. Now it's the time. All right, here's where the masterpiece starts. Here, I'll hold it for you, what's that? Okay. I'm actually not looking that bad. So you're actually, like, you like to draw on color, so you're good at yeah. art. Kind of thing inside the line. <laughs> I'm gonna do actually the blue first, and then after I'm gonna do the blue on both eyes first. Okay. And then I'm gonna do there. <laughs> it looks interesting. Yeah. My hands are shaking. <laughs> I thought it was probably one of the hardest parts for some people. I never used to wear a lot of eyeshadow. Really? Trying to do my best, it's kind of hard and it looks messy. Right? It's hard, yeah. Yeah, it's, my hands are shaking. If you want to, here, I'll show you even a, a nice little tip. If you get anything that falls off like on my face, you can just kind of like brush it away. Yeah, it's like inside. That one's fine, but this one's just like. A little smudge? Yeah. Smudge. Okay. Um, I'll just put that one back in there. Okay, now. that's fine. Or even use it with a clean finger, you can wipe it away if you want. That's just being a little worse. <laughs> Do you have any in your eyes? No. Huh? No, it's fine. Yeah, I think I made, I made that worse, but it kind of looks normal. I don't know. Hey, maybe you're creating a new look. Yeah, maybe. Maybe you can always, yeah. you can always add like lighter colors and blend them all yeah, in together. Yeah, I'm gonna use the pink Okay, that's a nice color. I actually used that one on my cheeks the other day. Really? Yep. How do you like mix them? Do you just like, put it over top? Yeah, you blend them into each other. But just like when you're like trying to think of what medium would be like paint and stuff, where you're blending two colors into each other. That makes sense. Yeah. Or like you fade two like pencil print colors together. It kind of looks like mermaid. Yeah. It looks interesting. You should look. No, I'll look after. Okay. I'll look at the end. Mix it on top. Oh yeah, you can see that. Nice color. Yeah, it's like an overlap. That looks nice. Kinda like cool down the blue. Cause the blue was very bright, so I'm gonna add this gold. Mm-hmm. My hand is not brush for that. 
Oh yeah, that's a good one. Oh wow. <laughs> oh yeah, that looks nice. Looks good. That's okay. But it looks quite nice. There we go. Pretty sure this is one of Kathy's favorites. She has it too. I'm gonna use some of the white. Okay. And because you choose a white, choose a clean brush. Yep, that's a good one. Yeah, because if you get it, then it won't be very white. Okay. Huh. It's very interesting. <laughs> okay, so we did eyeshadow. You think you're done? Yeah, I think I'm done. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. And now mascara. So I told her I would do mascara. Yeah, you do mascara. Just in case. Don't want to poke you in the Just, eye. Yeah, I don't want to poke or for, her to poke me in the For the eye. lipstick, I think I might. You know that, um, like one of these, but where you can mix the oh, lipsticks? Yeah. I think I might use it as well. You want to use that as well? It's in the other room. You want to grab it? Yes. Okay. So we're going to do lips. So now instead of lipsticks, you might use those too, but she was more intrigued by this Anastasia lip palette because you can mix. And I have the spatula. Yeah, so she can mix all of her own colors. Yeah. And you said you like, you're yeah. going to stick with the blue. Yes, yeah, stick with the blue thing. Make your own. It's more amazing, I think they would have one. Yeah, you can actually mix it on the lid if you want. Yeah, that I makes think sense. That. Yeah. Um, so I need to make green, I need. Mean. Whoa, that's smooth. Mm -hmm. Like this. So we had to help her mix a color because we did this one. I don't know what we were doing here. I don't, I don't that didn't work out too well. So, so we're we going. Made, we made this instead. Yeah. Like, it was just a little better. Yeah, that other color was not what we and wanted. And mint, it was kind of like. See, I was thinking of mint only because of this. Yes. That mint, that mint was nice, but but when we met made this color, it was kind of better. Yeah. So you use that if you want. Yep. I'm just gonna get this. Wow, that's a, that is blue. Oh, wow, that really is. Just notice that that's very blue. I feel like we should add a little white. Maybe, like, darker. Because that is very blue. Just like, because I missed some spots. That is very blue. Mm -hmm. Makes it look like I'm cold. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to add to it? Mm, I think a little green. Okay. Better than that green though. That green is awful. Yeah, <laughs> that's a pretty ugly green. Mm -hmm. um, oh yeah, hold 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 to this. Let me do here. I'll just do this. Oh, that's really nice. Ooh, and I like that because it has some blue to it. I kind of see some blue streaks in that. Mm -hmm. Ooh, yeah. Good combo? Yep. You do that so it doesn't get on your teeth. That's very interesting. <laughs> it's because it's so pastel. Yeah. Matches your eyes. Mm -hmm. Now setting spray. Setting spray, okay. And you, which one did you choose? I chose the mint. The mint one. So this is... Pixie. Pixie Hydrating Milky Mist. Milky. Milky Mist. Milky. Going for the budget one, not the expensive one. All right, spray it all over. Okay. <laughs> that's good. Oh, that's so good. Woo, that actually felt very nice. Here, I'm gonna fan myself. So shiny now. <laughs> It'll dry. I kind of look like a clown. Oh my yeah. 
Whoa! Wow, I should have waited for that reveal. Honestly, I thought that you would do worse with the eyeshadow. Yeah. But you did a really good job. I think so. For never touching makeup ever. I've seen adults do worse makeup. Uh, really? Mm. Oh, yep. Oh, wow. I've never had pastel lips before. <laughs> I've never seen pastel lips before. Maybe this is a new trend now. <laughs> new trend. Nora starts a trending page. <laughs> How do you feel about doing makeup? I like it, it's fun. Yeah? Yeah. What do you like the best, what's the best part? Um, all, all of it was pretty fun, but I think my favorite was the eyeshadow and the lipstick. Yeah, the lipstick was fun. So she first chose all pinks and red, and you went with blues. Yeah. I didn't know that I was going to do that. <laughs> I think, I think next time if we do this, you gotta go for colors more like this. Yes, more like this. She was like the Rihanna Beauty Glam by MAC. It was, roll it down. I know, she I mushed forgot. one of my lipsticks. She forgot to roll it down. Now I'm like, did you, you roll all the other ones down though. Yeah. I just thought it was just the one. Just that one. I, apparently I didn't want it to be pointy. No, you're like, oh, I'm like, yeah, it's brand new. You're like, all right guys. So that is it for today. I think Nora, honestly you did, uh, she did better than I thought she would. I like the lips. Yeah, I fixed them just. I fixed them just a little bit because they're a little bit on the outside yeah. of my lips, but now they look. They look. I like it because they look kind of purple. Yeah. The yeah, they're different colors. You can see it up close. It looks like different colors. Yeah. Anyways, I think we're gonna do this again. Yeah. I think it was fun. Yeah. And every time, single time, you'll get more and more comfortable with it. Yeah. Anyways, all right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye.